Hi, Python math, find angle MBC. We have a triangle 90 degree at B. Therefore, angle ABC is equal to 90 degree. The point M is the midpoint of the hypotenuse AC. And this is a right angle triangle. You are given the length AB and BC. Your task is to find the angle MBC. To find this angle MBC, we need to find the angle MCB because these two angles MBC and MCB should be equal. How? We will see. Because this is a right angle triangle and M is the midpoint of uh, AC, these two lines BM and AC. So BM will be equal to half of AC. It's a theorem and it holds true for all right angle triangles. So let me write that here. BM is equal to 1 by 2 into AC. Now we can write this AC as a sum of AM plus MC. And we know that M is the midpoint of uh, AC, therefore AM should be equal to MC. So instead of writing it as uh, AM plus MC, we can replace AM by MC. So which will be equal to half of 2MC. So half of 2MC is equal to MC. Therefore BM is equal to MC, which means this line BM is equal to this line MC. When two sides of a triangle are equal, it is called isosceles triangle. And in an isosceles triangle, this angle MBC is equal to this angle MCB. So let me write that here. MBC is equal to MCB. Now all we need to do is find this angle MCB then we will be able to figure out the angle MBC. Now how are we going to find the angle MCB? So if you consider this entire right angle triangle, uh, we have a formula tan theta is equal to opposite by adjacent. So let me write that uh, down here tan theta is equal to opposite divided by adjacent. If you can remember uh, the trigonometry. Yeah, so the opposite of uh, this angle MCB is the side AB. So tan theta is equal to AB divided by the adjacent of uh, uh, the angle MCB is BC. So tan theta is equal to AB divided by BC. Therefore theta is equal to tan inverse of AB by BC. Now this is what we need to find. So if we find this angle then we should be able to find uh, the MCB angle. Yeah. So let me comment this out and we will start coding for this. So first let us uh, take the uh, input and input we are getting it in two lines. So AB is equal to input and this input will be in uh, string data type. So we will convert it to integer uh, data type and uh, we will take the second input using the same. So BC is equal to again input. Cool. Now theta is equal to tan inverse. So in math to find the tan inverse we have the function a tan. a tan of ab divided by bc. So that is uh, uh, the equation. Now to use uh, this a tan function we need to import uh, this function from math. So from math import a tan. Yeah, so let me print out 
the theta value let's see the output yeah so we got the uh, integer but we need this value in uh, degrees so let's pass this entire um, theta value to the function degrees and to use this degrees function we need to import uh, that also from math so degrees and again we do not need any decimal point so we will uh, use uh, the round function to remove the decimal points yeah so let's see the output so 45 uh, we need this uh, degree symbol also here so to get the degree symbol we will use um, chr char of um, 176 if I'm not wrong let's run the code cool yeah so we got the degree symbol we just uh, we do not need the space here so let me pass another argument here is uh, is equal to empty space yeah so that's it let's run the code yeah so it's part pass the initial test case let me submit the code and it passed all the remaining test cases so that's the solution uh, if you like the video hit the like button and if you like the content subscribe to the channel thank you